Hi there, Michael Carroll here, founder of the London Hypnosis Academy. Welcome to this page, Hypnotic Healing. I am so looking forward to be running this course online on the 26th, 27th of February. Uh, we'll have a group of people from all over the world who have an interest in hypnosis and NLP and how hypnosis and NLP can be applied for your health and well-being. In this seminar, I'll be sharing with you processes that I have developed over the last 26 years where I use hypnosis uh, and some parts of NLP to coach people who have a whole variety of or people who come to me with various different health conditions to coach them to health and well-being. Some people say to me, how you know, can this happen? How does hypnosis work um, for helping people heal their bodies at a faster speed than might be traditionally expected um, within a medical prognosis? Well, firstly, the mind and body is a single system. You know, and one of, the con one of the challenges we face in the modern world is that we are becoming more and more disconnected from our bodies um, more and more and more and more into the processes of the mind. So, so many people are not even aware of their body. They don't, have, they don't really tune into it very regularly. So they're not aware of certain um, changes that occur within it. So firstly, with the hypnotic healing process, we teach people how to really use hypnosis. Firstly, to tune into the whole body, just to, on, a, on a regular basis to be aware of any shifts that occur before a symptom becomes a chronic symptom. So that's the first thing. Also, when it comes to healing, um, there are always exceptions in the medical world uh, for people who do not meet the medical prognosis. That is, they heal from chronic diseases at a faster speed than expected, um, or in some cases, heal from chronic, chronic diseases when they thought they may not heal at all and may pass away. Now, how does this happen? We're not sure how this happens naturally, but we all have within us that ability to heal. By using hypnosis, one of the challenges is that prevents rapid healing um, and also long-term health and well-being is the internal dialogue and the scripts we run for everyday life. That is, the scripts we believe about our health, the scripts we believe about our longevity, uh, and the scripts we believe about our emotions. All of these things that run inside our brains have an impact on our ability to heal. So by using hypnosis, you bypass the critical faculty. So limiting beliefs about health and well-being are out of the window. Limiting beliefs about one's ability to heal quickly are not there. In fact, you open your mind up in trance to your unconscious mind. And within your unconscious mind, you have your resources. And the unconscious mind is also the doorway to the immune system. So this is where you harness your resources to heal, outside of the scope of the conscious mind. And the results are just stunning. So we'll put a couple of links on the webpage you know, for some case studies of people who I have worked with who have had chronic disease, who Who's, which were terminal actually, which was diagnosed as terminal, who are now still alive because they have engaged with their unconscious mind to be able to support health and healing and long-term health and well-being. So this is not just about healing from diseases or illnesses. This is about setting your mind up for a life which includes optimised health, optimized energy for your well-being. 26th, 27th of February, li on, live online. I look forward to seeing you then. 
Thank you so much for watching this video.